Scorpio. Scorpio, welcome. Scorpio, general read. We're going to start with your current energy. So let's have a look at what your current energy is. Current energy for Scorpio, please. The world. Feeling pretty good. It's clarified by the Queen of Wands. Strength card. And justice. All right. Something could just be wrapping up for you. Um, with the strength card and justice, things may not be going that easy for you, but they are finishing up. You feel you're feeling better about things, but we see that there could be a divorce here with the justice card. And unfortunately it may be uncomfortable. This was your world and, oh, apologize. One sec, let's see if I can get my light back on here. There we go. Sorry about that. Um, your world might be getting shattered. It might be changing. Um, you might have been sitting pretty comfortable, but uh, you might be in for a shakeup. What is the desire for Scorpio? Six of Swords, Five of Wands, Nine of Swords, King of Swords. Yeah, we see that you want things to go easy. Um, things are changing in your current energy. Things are shifting. It may not stay that way. There's things that are happening with the Queen of Wands here. Things are moving. With the desire for things to go in a smoother direction, it's almost like you've been adverse to any type of change whatsoever. We have the five of wands that speaks of, you know, a little bit of change, but even that little bit of change puts you in your head and puts you on guard in a major way. It's like, Oh God, what else is going to happen next? It seems like you're waiting for the other shoe to fall. This worry that, Oh, okay. Well, this little bit for some of you, this is a major change. Like if we're looking at justice, uh, and the strength card, yeah, this could be a really difficult divorce for some of you that is rocking the world. Um, for others of you, this can be that the world is finally balancing out, that you're feeling really good, that your strength and determination has paid off and brought equality, has brought about uh, justice, if you will, leading that, you know, things are going smoother. <clears throat> what is the outcome? The Hierophant, Eight of Coins, Six of Coins, The Lovers. Hierophant speaks, and we have the Ace of Cups on the bottom of the deck. The Hierophant can speak to guidance. It can also speak to marriage. And with the Eight of Coins and Six of Coins, we see that the reciprocity and a major choice can be made here. Um, it's like if you put the effort in to this, if you made it, so maybe this is a catalyst for you. This sort of rocky road stuff right now is a catalyst for you to make a choice whether in a relationship you are actually going to be starting to be sharing what's going on where you're going to be an equal partner um, in this what is working for scorpio Page of Wands, the Sun, the Queen of Cups, and the Knave of Swords. Somebody's watching how you're handling this. Um, whatever information is coming in, it can be good, but uh, that makes you feel kind of wonderful. But somebody's watching how you handle this. Is it only going to be temporary? 
what you need to be aware of. The Hanged Man, the Empress, Temperance, Eight of Cups. If you don't do anything about this connection, this Empress, and balance things out, somebody's walking away. This could be you, this could be them. Um, you're making it out like it's possibly that it's all about you, and it's not. It's about both of you. Like, I've self-sabotaged, self-sacrificed, whatever. This Empress, Taurus energy, temperance, like, it's Sagittarian energy. But if this doesn't balance out, somebody's walking away. Was further advice for Scorpio, please. Thank you. Four of Cups, Knight of Cups, Five of Cups. You're not sure if this is genuine, uh, this Four of Cups. You're not sure if you really want to put that effort into it. You can see that it could be a good thing, but are you just going to stay the path that you're on and live to regret it? Really freaking heavy read for you, Scorpio. Um, best of luck this week. Feel free to give this a thumbs up or thumbs down. I'd give it a thumbs down because it's a really stinking heavy read. Uh, but that's what I have for you today, Scorpio. But I hope this week's better than your next or last. We'll talk to you next time. Stay safe.